It didn't feel like much of a cushion. I don't know about you guys, but it felt like it was a, you know, a nip-tuck game. And uh, that's, again, kind of goes to William and Mary for that. They, they fought and uh, you know, battled. And again, a, a group of guys that all really stepped into new roles this year. And now, 24 games into the season, I think they're more and more comfortable with those roles. I'm a little unrealistic. I don't, you know, I don't want to win them all. But uh, I am pleased with our progress. Uh, and I think that's more important to me at least on a record. I think we are ahead of schedule uh, defensively compared to last year's team. Uh, didn't really show tonight, but I think overall, uh, you know, we're guarding really well. And that's what we're gonna have to do in the month of February if we wanna be successful, is keep getting better and better on the defensive end, and then it helps to have offensive nights like we have tonight. We're just so fortunate, all of us up here in, in our whole program, to have the fans that we have. Uh, you know, tonight, uh, I don't know how many VCU fans were here, but there was a whole lot of them and they were loud and they were boisterous and they supported us. And every time that we go to an opposing arena, I'm reminded of how special of an opportunity we have uh, you know, to coach and play at VCU.